something that is very surprising to people is that any drug that they have ever taken, whether it's aspirin or the latest antibody from a biotech company, only one or two percent of the dose that they receive actually makes it to the area that they want. The drug ends up in areas that you do not want, like your liver and your kidney, and that can lead to side effects. My name is Jose Mejia Neto, and I'm the CEO of Tambo. I was fascinated with science and with chemistry and with understanding the way the world worked very early on. So there was a sense of duty that I had to contribute to making the lives of others that were less fortunate better. It seemed to me that the National Science Foundation were more interested in the breakthrough and what it would mean for the future. So that drove me to apply to the NSF, happened with the NSF funding, in which it started becoming more tangible. This was possible, it's not pie in the sky. Uh, scientists have actually looked at this and are saying this is something where there would be need uh, and it's feasible to create something. That, that it was actually happening was really comforting, really validating and really rewarding. Cancer therapies create a significant deal of side effects. We know where a tumor is. Can we have something that tells cancer drugs to go to that specific location? What we're doing is applying this new technology called click chemistry in order to make drugs less toxic, have fewer side effects, but have a greater efficacy at the area where you want it to have it. What we have created is a biopolymer that you can inject in that area, remains in that area for multiple weeks, and then that gets drugs to be activated in that specific area. So we are now turning a drug that would be everywhere else in your body to be inactivated only at that specific space, wherever that biopolymer is. This technology has been started on the belief that we can do things better. We're really looking forward to seeing how our contribution truly provides cancer drugs with fewer side effects and greater uh, efficacy. And we expect that this will be the tip of the iceberg for how other therapies get modified in the future.